Hey Virgo, welcome to Virgo Speaks Tarot. I'm Shawnee. Welcome to your reading. Happy Friday, guys. Woo, we have made it to the end of the work week. Virgo, I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. Man, I hope you guys are having a good time today. Just enjoying having, you know, just embracing that inner joy. Peace, happy to be alive. Um, feeling the Christmas spirit. Let's see what's going to give you some good vibes today. Woo. We got some messages coming out. Oh, my God. Look at this. Virgo, of course, this is going to get you in good vibes. We have abundance planning. Look at you guys. So today after work, you guys are, I'm getting the energy of like at night. You guys maybe you know, doodling in your, like, you know, jotting down you know, goals, plans for 2024 on how you can get more money, how you can tap into this abundance, you guys. Wow. So I feel like you guys, this is what's going to make you feel good. Okay. When you're putting down a solid plan or you're just getting everything out that you want to manifest on paper. Okay. So this is good, Virgo. I'm loving it. I'm loving the energy. I'm loving the vibes. We got 10, 20, 50, 100s. You guys are focused on money. Okay. Did I show you guys this card? You guys are, you got your mind on your money and your money on your mind. I don't blame you guys. I feel you. Wow. Okay. So look, we have get up and dance. This weekend, you guys might find yourself, you know, having pleasure and hanging out with friends. Okay. Um, dancing. This is like a party. So this weekend you may be invited to like a party, a get together, a gathering, whether it's music, dancing, you're just feeling free. You're enjoying yourself. Spirit just said a Christmas party. Um, or this could be new year's Eve vibes. I'm picking up Virgo. I feel like you guys are going to be chilling, you know, as well, watching TV, watching a movie tonight. Netflix and chill, baby. Okay. For some of you, you're going to be cuddled up with your pet, enjoying some, either some, some drink, you know, some champagne, some, some liquor, some wine or some tea or some coffee or something you guys got in that coffee mug. But I see you guys chilling. You could be thinking about watching like a love movie or I'm getting the vibe of like a scary movie. Okay. So, Virgo, this is what's going to get you in good vibes, okay? Um, for some of you, you need to get out the house, start moving around, start dancing, having a good time. Virgo, this is what you guys need. Invite some friends over, some family, you know, hang out with a co-worker, you know, you know, if you do those kind of things. Because some people are like, uh-uh, at work, I leave that. At work, I do not mix personal with work but if you have a good friend virgo someone that you enjoy hanging out with i definitely advise this weekend let your hair down have some fun virgo all right for some of you you're like eh, i'm in my hermit mode i'd rather stay at home and enjoy a movie and i'm totally digging that vibe as well all right so we have pleasure Ooh, spirit has a <laughs> spirit has a very specific message for some of you. Okay, we have connect with your womb. Okay, and we have pleasure. All right, so for some of you, <laughs> this uh, evening you guys are gonna be getting connected with yourself. All right, and I don't blame you, honey. All right, so. Yeah, look at this. I can't make it up. We have alone time. All right, Virgo. So I feel like you guys just really need that. You know, for some of you, you're like, you know what? I didn't been outdoors. I didn't been out. I just need some alone time with me. I need to get connected with self here. All right. For some of you, you just need some pleasure in your life. Get some ice cream, your favorite ice cream. For some of you, is actual um, intimacy <laughs> that you may be missing at this time, Virgo. 
So I, ooh, I can't make this up, you guys. We have SEX here. All right, so for some of you, this is what's heavy on your mind. This is what's going to make you feel good this weekend. All right, so Virgo, um, take this as it resonates. We have music, okay? I feel like you guys are going to be totally into the vibe this weekend, just enjoying yourself. We have sound healing. Are you guys into that, sound healing? Um, sometimes it's a little weird for me. I don't know what it is. For some of you, you're going to be cleaning your home this weekend. All right. I'm totally feeling that. I'm going to be, um, I just bought a brand new bed, like a bed, um, set. So I'm going to be, um, getting that set up this weekend. So you guys, for some of you, you may be getting your home together, things like that. You know, deep cleaning. I'm totally feeling it. Because with me, when my house is so spotless. I just love the energy. Oh my God. It's so amazing just to have everything just spotless clean. I mean, it's almost like borderline OCD. Like you just don't want anything out of place. You know, it's like, I get so crazy with it where the whole house is clean. I don't even want to pull out a dish. I mean, that's how crazy I can get sometimes, but Virgo, I'm loving the vibes, guys. This weekend is going to be nothing, but it's like for two groups of you, you're just, the main energy is feel good, right? The main energy here is feel good vibes, Virgo. This weekend, expect to feel good. Expect to be doing things that make you feel good amazing. All right. So focus on pleasure this weekend, Virgo. Focus on doing things that make you feel free, opened up, feeling loose, feeling good. Okay. That's very important, guys. All right, Virgo. So I just want to get a message here on how we can help Virgo loosen up a little bit or is there, whoo, yeah, we have a message flying out. We have compassion for all. I'm getting animals. Look at this. This is beautiful. For some of you, you are so connected to animals. It's amazing. Like, I mean, this is just an, a beautiful connection, okay? It's like almost, it's like you birthed that animal into this world. It's so amazing how close and connected you can be with an animal. I don't know who this is, um, but you have an animal that, or animals that are, that, you know, attract to you. They love your energy. They love your, your energy of just wanting to have like a good time or good vibes. Let's see. Compassion is the beating heart of all spiritual practices. The peace you seek comes from the peace you create. Extend your compassion to all beings today, Virgo, including yourself. Everyone benefits when you are kind. May all beings be happy and free. Oh my God. So it's like if you're out eating outdoors, you see some birds, drop a little, you know, some little breadcrumbs. You know, this is just sweet. I mean, of course, after you're done, you know, save a little bread for the birds. But I'm just like, Virgo, this is beautiful. Um, Just today, just have an open heart for everyone. Even the people in the office that annoy you, try to smile and just be kind because this energy is so addicting, okay? And you never know how powerful your effect, you know, your kindness can affect someone. Also, compassion is the beating heart of all spiritual practices. So if you're trying, you know, if you've been working on raising your vibration, manifesting through like sex magic, or, you know, just, um, you know, just heavy, heavy, you know, doing visual work, Virgo, having an open, beautiful heart and com compassion for all beings is key. Ooh. This deck wants to come out is key. All right. So this deck wanted to come out. So Virgo, let's see what else we have for you guys today, because this is going to be a light, very fun, very carefree reading for Friday. Okay. So today we're not going to work. We're not going to focus on what work we need to do. Let's just and focus on enjoying ourselves. Okay. Today. Virgo, try not to do too much. 
okay? Let this day be the day of fun, pleasure, good time. Let loose, okay? Random acts of randomness. <laughs> All right, Virgo. And I need to follow my own advice, okay? I need to follow my own advice. All right, Virgo. So this deck wanted to come out. What is your message, Holy Spirit, for Virgo? For today, December 15th, we have high vibes. We're feeling good. We're enjoying ourselves. What is the message for today for Virgo that's vibing high? For my lovely Virgos. Mm -hmm. So we have occupation. So Virgo, what is going on when it comes to you at work? All right. So we have occupation. Oh my God. No, the coffin ain't at the bottom of the deck. Come on now, spirit. We don't need this kind of energy today. All right. What is going on? For some of you, it don't have to be a, a, a dang, I shuffled it and it's still there. For some of you, this doesn't have to be a loss of a job. Okay, occupation, coffin. This can be you calling off from work today, okay? Um, I'm not trying to promote that, but this could be you trying to call off from work. Like, shoot, I, Virgo, I hope y'all ain't saying y'all had a death in the family to call off from work. But that's what could be happening today. Y'all like, you know what? I'm focused on myself today, okay? Shoot. All right, Virgo. I don't blame you. You know, we're the hardest workers out there. When it comes to Virgo, what is the message here when it comes to occupation? <laughs> I feel like you guys are working hard today. It's Friday. Enjoy yourself, Virgo. Yeah, we have main female here. So we have female energy. Okay, and this looks like the same woman, Virgo. I feel like you guys, I feel like you're gonna be at work today, but then you got something special going on tonight. Are you guys? Oh my god, I miss those office work parties. <laughs> Do you guys remember those? Are you guys are you guys experiencing because I don't work in the office anymore? Do you are you guys going to the office parties? How do you guys feel about them? I love them. All the free food, the cookies, the you know how they have the little um buffet of items. Everybody brings something. I remember I brought fried chicken. Everybody, my team lead was so happy. She was like, Oh my gosh, Tony, you about the fried chicken. I'm like, Yeah, girl, we finna eat, okay. But Virgo, I feel like you guys got somewhere to go. Something, somewhere very special because she's working her butt off here at work. You know, hair not really done, you know, no makeup on. It's like she's at work. I'm not here to look good for nobody. But you know what? After work, okay, I'm going to dress up nice. Got my hair done. I got somewhere to go. That's the energy I'm picking up. Virgo, let me see what's going on. I want to get one more message for Virgo. We're going to dive in and see what plans Virgo have for today. Yep, you guys may be invited somewhere really nice. We have family room. This could be family. This could be a Christmas party with family, friends. Okay, this is a, I knew it, it was a very nice place. All right, you could be at a mother's house, a grandmother's house, an aunt. There's somebody's house that you're going to after work. It's going to be a nice party. It could be a friend. It's somebody that has a really nice home, okay? Um, I see you dressed up really nice, very pretty. If it's a male, Virgo, I see you're going to be very handsome, okay? Or you may be inviting um, like a female, okay? Or you may be invited to some sort of party, all right, so let's see what's going on with Virgo. I feel like this is some kind of event. Let's see what's going on with Virgo. We're going to get this tarot. So what's going on with Virgo today? What is going on with this occupation card? For my lovely Virgos, what's going on with this occupation What's happening? Okay, we have cards that shot out the deck. All right, Virgo. So we have the Queen of Wands. All right. Someone who is, this is your energy. 
coming out as the Queen of Wands. So this is someone who's very brilliant, talented, someone who's very independent, okay? There is nothing you can't do today, Virgo. Believe in yourself. Never underestimate your ability to make your dreams come true. The need for balance between career and personal life. So for some of you, I feel like you may be calling off from work today. You're like, you know what? I've been putting in too many hours. I've been, you know, I've been working really hard. You know, I might need to take a day off today. All right. That's what I'm picking up for some of you. It's like you're just working really, really hard. Like you're just going all in and you may not have been making time for yourself, Virgo. That's what I'm picking up here. Um, I feel like there's a lot of competition at work. Um, I feel like there's there's somebody here at work. We have an unwise choice. There's a better way that will make you happier. Avoid people who lack integrity or who have questionable motives. All right. So Virgo, I feel like at work, you're dealing with people like this. Okay. People who have questionable motives. Okay. And spirit is just like, don't question yourself at work. Know that you are all that in a bag of chips. Know that you are the queen of wands energy. You can get anything done. You can manifest whatever you want. All right. And there's nothing that can stop you. So Virgo, when you're at work, just know how brilliant, talented that you really are. Okay. Yeah. Believe in yourself. Okay. When it comes to work and these people who may be stealing, cheating, you know, people who lack integrity at work, people with questionable... Mo yeah, be careful of these people at work is what I'm seeing here, Virgo. What is the... Clarify the Queen of Wands here when it comes to Virgo and this occupation. Virgo, we have renewal... Okay, so this is reviewing the past with compassion. This is what we were talking about in the reading about compassion. Okay, so reviewing the past with compassion and forgiveness. Time to, time to head in a new direction. Clarity on your life purpose. In your heart, you know what to do. So there's a renewal here coming. Oh my God, look at this. There's a family here. All right, so Virgo, I feel like um, there's forgiveness needed here. There may be somebody at work that you may be beefing with or having like some kind of like, in like, I'm getting like some intensity here. There may be some sort of conflict at work. All right, but I'm getting like, that's that message I was giving, like having strong compassion for people. This is going to go far for you. These people who have, you know, lack of integrity, they may be used to people acting out a certain way once they reveal their true colors. But if you continue to speak, hi, good morning, or, you know, continue to treat this person with kindness, this can, uh, you know, may penetrate this person, you know, um, all right, it may penetrate this person. And I feel like that's what's needed here in the workplace for you to continue to have integrity, continue to be this person of forgiveness and compassion, okay, as the queen of wands. But at the same time, I feel like you're not the one to cross, okay? That's what I'm picking up. Like you're forgiving, you're loving, you're, you have compassion, but you're not the one to play with as well is what I'm picking up. All right, Virgo, when it comes to the main female, yeah, you're not the one to mess with at work, Virgo. All right, that's what I'm picking up heavy. All right, let me get a quick message. Spirit is saying, okay, what is the message here for Virgo? When it comes to occupation, we have, oh my God, can you believe the coffin came out again? Um, Virgo, for some of you, I mean, hey, you may be thinking about leaving this job. Like, it's just too many snakes here, you know. Um, for some of you, 
You may have been lacking compassion for the people at work or, you know, the people you're dealing with on a daily basis. But I'm seeing like, for some of you, you may go ahead and forgive and decide to leave this job and move on to something else. Okay. Um, the coffin also represents transformation, uh, ending. Okay. So there may be, um, there may be a, a big change here happening in your job that you don't see a renewal. Okay. Um, a big change. So these people that, you know, that drive you crazy at work, these people who lack integrity, you know, they liars, they're cheaters, you know, they're con artists, they're not kind to the people they work with over the phone or in person. They're just like snakes. And I feel like Virgo, there's going to be a huge change. It's like, it's coming to an end. It's like, you need to be this leader, the queen of wands of, of, um, like a role model. Okay. And I feel like, I don't know why, but for this situation that might impact it on a major level. Yeah. I keep seeing, um, this abundance card. I keep seeing the cross have faith and the tree card represents wisdom and the past. All right, so let's see what else is going on here. When it comes to this main female, what is the message for Virgo today, Friday? For some of you, you guys have been having some struggles at work. But don't worry, Virgo, what I'm seeing, you're going to overcome those struggles. When it comes to the main female, what's going on for Virgo? Ooh. We have cards everywhere. Awakening happening. And we have, what is this card? Oh, we have the Six of Pentacles. What? Virgo. So we have an awakening happening. This is like the hangman energy, a temporary pause for reflection and insight. So Virgo, that's what's going on today. You guys are going to, this is that moment where you just pause and just think, okay? You're having some sort of epiphany, some sort of, you know, um, like reflecting moment. All right. And it's like an awakening where you see things in a whole new light. Embrace your own uniqueness. This is charitable actions. Wow. And 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 this is what it is. Here's those charitable actions. Virgo, look at this. All right. So all that you do, the good that you do comes back to you, Virgo. Just know that. An unexpected inflow of abundance, borrowing wisely or paying off a debt sharing your wealth with others less fortunate all right virgo is very very big and i feel like just your good spirit your beautiful light is the wealth that you're sharing okay for some of you um i feel like those acts of kindness is going to go far especially in the workplace especially if you're in a leadership position all right, Virgo, so expect some sort of awakening and looking at things from a different light, a different perspective, okay? You're going to realize that all the good that you do does come back to you, and it feels really good, okay, to do this type of charitable work. We have family room, all right? So what is the message when it comes to family room? I definitely feel like there's going to be a lot of conversations, a lot of tea, you know, a lot of a lot of gossiping. I don't know why I'm picking that up, but uh, it's going to be a lot of talking. It's like people that are going to be hooking up that haven't seen each other in a while. We have, um, what is this? We have the Four of Pentacles. Managing your resources wisely, Virgo. When it comes to this party you may be invited to, you may be like, oh, I need to go out and buy a new dress, okay? I need to go get my hair done. I need to get my nails done. I need to get some new shoes. Like, Spirit is like, hold on, Virgo. You guys might need to manage your resources wisely. Extremes in how you give or receive money, okay? So this is going to be good. Like, you could be spending a lot of money or you could be getting a lot of money, okay? Time or emotions, okay? Take it as it resonates. Smart business decisions, seeing things as black or white. 
Either I got it or I don't. This can also be being charitable. So Virgo, you are being very charitable this weekend. For some of you, you may find yourself donating toys, gifts for Christmas. You may be going to a charitable dinner party or event. All right, Virgo, I'm loving this. I'm loving this energy, guys. You may be going to some sort of charitable event. And you're like, I can afford it, you know? Wow, this is so cute. Um, Virgo, there's some sort of business decision as well. A very smart business decision that's coming in. What is this? We have the Eight of Pentacles. This is about work and how you make money. There's going to be a smart business move. I don't know if this is networking, but at this family room, there's going to be some sort of gathering here where you're going to be talking about doing some sort of charitable event, something that where you're going to either give money or receive money. This is going to happen very fast. And we have the world card. This is a brilliant success. All right. So Virgo, I don't know what this is, but I'm seeing a lot of networking. I'm seeing... Um, this is a time for accomplishment, spiritual enlightenment, freedom to do whatever you want. Be proud of yourself, guys. This is the world's card. All right. So Virgo, you may find yourself feeling so free, so empowered to make boss moves this weekend. Something's gonna, there's an awakening happening. All right, guys, where you're like, you know what? I'm meant to do something else here. This can be keeping your job, but doing something else as well, or just decide to do something different completely. But spirit wants you to know you have the power, you have the spiritual enlightenment and the freedom to do whatever you want. And you can move as fast as you want, but just know that all of this energy that's coming is going to, can overwhelm you. All right. Too much can feel like is going on. Stress caused by many positive opportunities. All right. So it can be so much going on that it can cause a little stress. Okay. Unexpected events or rapid changes. So you guys can be suddenly invited somewhere and it can, you know, stress you a little bit. But Spirit is saying, have the ability to multitask. This can also be traveling for business. All right, Virgo, so this is big. This is beautiful. This is your energy for the weekend. Um, starting today, Friday, enjoy the rest of your day, guys. I will be back to see what's going on when it comes to new love in your life, Virgo. But this is the energy. I'm loving it. You're empowered and abundant. All right, Virgo, and you're not afraid to share the love and work hard and, 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 and share that compassion and joy. So beautiful, guys. I'm loving it. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm out of here, Virgo. Bye now. This little notification. <laughs> All right. Bye, Virgo.